This is Qbert for the Atari 2600. And Qbert was like a B-list celebrity in the 80s, uh, as far as video game characters are concerned. He never quite got up to A-list celebrity status like Pac-Man or Donkey Kong or Frogger. But I always liked Qbert. Not only was it an incredibly fun game, and it really was. It was very clever. You start off on the top of this pyramid and jump down. And uh, as you can see, try to hit all the blocks and get them to be all the same color. But the best part about Qbert is that he swore when he hit something. And I, I always thought that a swearing orange video game character was, was, was pretty hip. I was down with Qbert. As the game progresses, it gets more difficult, like most Atari games, but instead of just speeding up, instead of hitting the blocks once to make them change color, you have to hit them twice to make them change colors. Maybe they go from blue to yellow to pink. Qbert requires a good bit of skill, and consequently, it's, it's a pretty tough game once you, once you actually get into it. And this is one that you most definitely should add to your collection. Now, I don't know why, but for whatever reason, he reminds me of Alf. 